In this video, we have given that m square plus 8 is equal to 3 power n and we have to find on positive integers m and n. So we have m square plus 8 and m square is 0 or 1 mod 4 and 8 is 0 mod 4. So m square plus 8 will be congruent to 0 or 1 mod 4 and 3 power n 3 power n is congruent to minus 1 power n that is congruent to minus 1 or 1 mod 4. So we have given that m square plus 8 is equal to 3 power n. So m square plus 8 will be congruent to 3 power n that will be congruent to 1 mod 4 because 1 is common in both terms. So we get 3 power n is congruent to 1 mod 4 that means n is even n is even. So if we assume n is equal to 2k let n is equal to 2k then we get m square plus 8 is equal to 3 power 2k and it is 3 power 2k minus m square is equal to 8 and 3 power 2k is 3 power k square minus m square is equal to 8 and a square minus b square is equal to a plus b into a minus b. So we get 3 power k plus m into 3 power k minus m is equal to 8 and we have m and n positive integers. So 3 power k plus m will be positive integer and 8 is also positive integer. So we get 3 power k minus m is also positive integer. And of course 3 power k plus m will be greater than 3 power k minus m and we have product of 3 power k plus m and 3 power k minus m is equal to 8. So we get 3 power k plus m and 3 power k minus m is equal to either it is 8 and 1 or it is 4 and 2. So if we take case 1 when 3 power k plus m is equal to 8 and 3 power k minus m is equal to 1 then if we add both terms then we get 3 power k is equal to 8 plus 1 by 2 and we get 3 power k is equal to 9 by 2 and 3 power k is integer but 9 by 2 it is not integer. So this is not possible. So we have to consider case 2. Case 2 when 3 power k plus m is equal to 4 and 3 power k minus m is equal to 2. So again if we add both terms then we get 3 power k is equal to 4 plus 2 by 2 or 3 power k is equal to 6 by 2 that is 3 or 3 power k is equal to 3 power 1 so we get 
k is equal to 1 and we have 3 power k minus m is equal to 2 we have 3 power k minus m is equal to 2 and k is equal to 1 so we get 3 minus m is equal to 2 or m is equal to 3 minus 2 that is 1 and n is equal to 2k that is 2 so m and n is equal to m is 1 and n is 2 it is the only value of m and n